Yo, what is up everyone and welcome back to another video. My name is Joshua Winkins. In this video, I want to go over how to create this really cool free TV overlay effect right here. And this is what the effect looks like right here. Now I'll put the download link in the description below. This effect is from Cinepax. I believe there is an actual paid pack, but I'm just going to go over the free pack. Primarily going over this effect right here. And again, like I said before, it is free, so don't worry. It's not going to cost you a penny to create this very simple little effect. But I think it's a really cool, interesting effect. And yes, it's definitely one of those effects where it's not going to be like used in every single video. But there are definitely a time and a place for this kind of effect. And I personally am a big fan of this effect. So the first thing you want to do is you want to download this video right here, which is from Cinepax. And again, the link is going to be in the description below so let's go ahead and just create a new project i'll just go over how to create this this effect isn't a super difficult effect but i'm going to go over basically step by step how to create this effect what we're going to do is we're going to obviously find your clip so i'll go to here obviously you'd actually import it but i'm just going to copy it over to this project right here so here is the clip right here and I'll go ahead and just reset the position and scale because obviously this is what it would look like if it was just a normal video right here. So here is your normal video right there. So you have a video right here. This is going to just be your video. It can obviously be anything. In this instance, this is just a screen recording from just basically an NFL. Just NFL footage. I obviously don't own this footage. Just in case you were wondering, I don't work for the NFL. This is just a clip that I found. What you're going to do is you're going to head over, scroll down. I mean, obviously, you're going to import um, the TV effect. I believe I'll just go over here to import right here. And we'll go ahead and just head over here. I believe it's this one I'll try okay, it's this one right here warehouse TV or this one. warehouse TV 08 so this is the effect right here and this is what so you want to import this warehouse TV and then 8 dot movie this is the effect that you're gonna to want to import right here but I mean obviously I already have the footage import or the, the effect imported right here so you want to take the effect right here Put it over your video obviously crop it if necessary right here so there you go here's the effect now, as you can see you don't have to add a keying effect there's no there's no key effect there's no changing the blend mode is not changed at all it's literally just like a transparent background right there so all you have to do is just apply it onto your video right here now you look at it and say okay well that's good that's exactly what I want then that's perfectly fine but if I were you I might want to just decrease the scale a little bit right here so what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead head of the transform tool and we're just going to start in decreasing the scale right here um, and you want to make sure as you can see you don't want any black background right here so let's maybe increase it to I don't know 65% right here and that looks pretty good well, obviously you can keep adjusting it the crop the scale the position everything like that until you get the look you want that's of course a personal preference and whatever whatever look you want to go for um, that's up to you but this is just what I went for right here so this is what the effect looks like right here at this really cool um, TV effect and there you go you basically just recreate the effect it's not a super complicated effect but I just want to show you where to download this effect and what you can do with this effect right here so of course you just want to apply the effect on top of your clip and then adjust your clip accordingly whether you want it really zoomed out or really zoomed in that of course um, is all up to you and that's literally basically how you create this really cool effect right here now you may not want this flashing um, light thing, light background or whatever you want to call it. I believe this is right here. Yeah, as you can see right here, there is nothing happening. There's no flashing light in the background. This is literally just a PNG image right here. So you can just go ahead and download this. There won't be any flashing lights in the background, but if you want flashing lights, then go ahead and use the other one. Now this pack also comes with a whole bunch of different VHS overlays right here um, and you have a whole bunch of different stills right here you can obviously go through and find um, the look that you want I just wanted to just kind of go over the TV effect right here uh, you also have a couple of different sound effects right here in the pack and then you have the different overlays right here this is probably a good one for Instagram but this is the one that I like it has the flashing lights right here and again if you do not want the flashing lights, you don't want that flashing light in the background, 
you can just go ahead and just import this PNG image right here. So I definitely go ahead and encourage you to download um, this effect. Again, it's completely free. It does not cost anything, and it is from Cinepax. I also have an affiliate link there, so if you want to actually buy the paid pack or buy a different paid pack, you can go ahead and use my code um, Joshua Winkins to get five dollars off your order, just in case you want to actually start buying the paid pack. But not everyone's gonna have forty, fifty dollars to spend on a pack for Final Cut Pro 10. So if you don't have a bunch of money, you can go ahead and just download these free packs. I'm gonna do a whole bunch of free pack uh, tutorials in the future. So look forward to a whole bunch of Cinepax videos. Kind of go over the ones that I like and the ones that I don't like, and hopefully some of the ones you find really useful. That being said, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you found it helpful and informative. If you do this channel, I upload Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials every day at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So if you enjoy these types of videos, consider hitting that subscribe button. I also have Final Cut Pro 10 tutorial playlist with over 130 Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials. See you in the next one. Peace. Thank you.